the blitz. My girl Ronnie Hunter is a VJ. Is that what they call them, VJs? And my sister's boyfriend's a VJ on here. Baker. Ryan Baker. They're all at Rock on the Range right now, and I'm at home. Well, I'm not at home right now, obviously. I am on my way to the Dollar Tree before I head to Jordan's basketball tournament. So I've been rearranging things all day in the house to set up my craft room downstairs. So I don't think that I'm gonna show you guys the videos until it's complete. So like today I just did some video of the process of me cleaning things out and stuff. Um, but I don't have uh, it even close to being done. Like I still have to get the couch out of there, their TVs, their TV stands, but I moved some furniture around and it's, um, my arm hurts to hold my phone right now because I'm worn out. <laughs> so I did color my hair though. See? Oh, there's still a piece of gray I see. But anyway, um, I got that accomplished and I'm trying to think of what else. I haven't been to Dollar Tree for a while, I feel. So I am going to the one in um, the town over that is not the one I get to go to all the time because I go to two by my work. So I'm going to hit this place up before I go to Jordan's game. And I will show you guys what I got later if I get anything good. Um, I have like a list of what I need to get for sure. That's a new house being built. Um, and then we have Lydia's graduation Sunday. So I'll see what I can come up with. But that's my Friday. I, I played hooky today. Let me just say, I truly, I needed a mental wellness day. Is that what it's called? I was ready to quit my job yesterday. Um, there's just more crazy stuff. Like, well, I didn't get granted the transfer, just so you guys know. So everybody was like, well, put in your two-week notice, and maybe then they'll, they'll do it so they don't lose you. And I'm like, but I can't risk not having another job lined up. So, um... And then there was just craziness. The police, like this crazy lady is accusing somebody of shooting up her apartment. There was no bullets, but the guy she accused of shooting up the place is the same one. That is why my, oh, there's a state trooper. So random. I like country, I like rock, I like hip hop, I love me some R&B. I'm an R&B girl t at heart, like Babyface, I can sing every song to you beginning to end. Keith Sweat, mm-hmm. You know what's crazy? My sister-in-law was so young she didn't know who Keith Sweat was. I was like, that's just a travesty. Is travesty a word? Because I just used it like I knew what it meant. So, my double chin, you see that right there? I'm trying to hide it. Hopefully it's not noticeable. But why am I still breaking out at 37? Like, what's up with that? Anyway, so my whole, I just want to tell you guys real quick. Um, so, I guess, apparently, guns, Mm -hmm. Parents with guns threatened to kill all the kids and other people. And then group retaliated, bunch of guys in SUVs with guns trying to shoot up. Yeah, so that was Wednesday night after I left. So I was informed of all this yesterday. And then when I left yesterday, I was informed by the police officer, police, that um, one, there was a dumpster fire, mail and trash. And I'm like, what? 
Yeah, uh, they set it on fire. Somebody robbed all, oh, I meant to go that way. Robbed a bunch of areas outside of my, my community and then just dumped it there and all the checks, the mail with checks were missing um, from the debris they found. Why, why dump it on my property? And then yesterday, so she had reported that, that was the day before. I didn't even know about it. And then she reported yesterday, after I left, that there was a, another dumpster fire, but that one she believes to be kids. Why? Why is this even happening? So anyway, I was at my wit's end. At that point, I just, last night, I was like, I just don't, I hate to say I don't feel safe, but I guess I don't. I needed a mental health day. That's what it is, mental health, not mental wellness, but I do need it to be well. So I didn't go to work today. I needed it and I feel good. We're in my bedroom. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys what I got real quick before I start putting it away because I have some stuff I want to do with it. Um, I don't know. It rained. And so we're having a cookout um, for family and stuff like around the 4th of July. So I got, look how cute. I thought it was adorable, the checkered. Look at this one. So you got red, white, and blue. I thought it was adorable. Very cute. So I got those, and then to go along with that theme, I got these plates. So there's 14 plates per pack. So I had to get quite a few, five of them. But aren't they adorable? And they're square, and so they sink, and then I just think they're gorgeous. And then time to put the napkins. There is 20 napkins per pack. Thought they were cute. Um, and then to round that stuff up, I came across these. So we already have some of these yeah. here. Um, there's four in a pack. Yeah four pieces. They're just the little baskets. And so they had the checkered, like, what do they call it? Wax basket liners. But I thought that'd be so cute for Travis to put like, I don't know. Like I buy the stuff, he cooks and puts it together. Cause I don't do that. I just find what's cute and I try to make it happen. So that's for the cook. I apologize if you could hear him. He's playing video games. I hope you didn't hear that, he just cussed. Okay, so I saw somebody haul this and I have not been able to find one since. And I was at the checkout and guess what I found? It was the only one of her. I have no idea where I'm gonna put it, what I'm gonna do with it, but I got it. You know what? I might put it on my rear view mirror. Do you think that'd be too much of an obstruction of my view? It says it's a keychain. That's too big to go on my keys. It would drive me crazy. And it would break off because I throw my keys in my purse. I've already broke half of them. Isn't that cute? So I think I might put that on my rear view mirror. And, oh, more of these. I didn't realize I had more. Um, a lot of this is kind of just household stuff. I got Pop-Tarts. They didn't have brown sugar cinnamon at this one. Um, I got some erasers. So I use mechanical pencils for to, when I play my su Sudoku. I think I said it right. And my system of doing it, I do a lot of erasing. So with that, I run out of the eraser before I do the lead. So I got these just to throw on. Look how, you get quite a bit, 40 of them. Like, I really don't think I'm gonna use 40. So maybe the kids can use those for school. 
And then I got, I, okay, so it started storming like insane. I'm gonna put a picture just to show you the aftermath, how dark and scary it was. So bad. So I just was like, I'm not going out in that. And I had plenty of time before I had to be at my son's game, so I walked around. And you know what happens when you do that? You buy more stuff. I put toenail polish on. And I thought it was dry, and I put a sock on. It's like we're... So I could, uh... Hey! He's cussing. Sorry, I feel like my hair is, like, all in my face. Anyway, so I went back through, and they don't have any burlap there. They didn't... Like, they have so much of some stuff. It's just crazy how the dollar stores are stocked. Like, some dollar stores... Dollar trees have, like, an abundance of a couple areas and lack so much in the others and so anyway this is um five yards of just says gross gross grain ribbon is that how you say it but it's just white no travis <laughs> so obnoxious i swear the older i get the more sensitive my ears are and i know that sounds so silly because like i'll listen to music blaring but it's like certain noises like yelling or um, the buzzer at the basketball games. Oh, I hate it. So anyway, I plan on like, I can use this as white or I can coffee dye it or I can, um, you know, glimmer mist or spray it, you know, and color it, whatever. And then I just got a Brillo pen, Brillo basics. So what I have now is big. And this way this will just sit on the sink nicer and I can just, you know, clean it with bleach, but before you put stuff in the dishwasher. And then I'm gonna post a picture at the end of this to show you guys. Remember, um, oh, I don't think it works. I kept that uh, lantern that I was originally gonna give my stepmom. And I found one I like better for her. Why does it say test me and then it doesn't work? I'm gonna lose my mind. Maybe I'm gonna have to check this later. <gasps> there it works. Whew, I was about to be mad. Anyway, I got that to put in there. I'm making messes. So that's that see what else I got. Don't shop when you're hungry. I got this. I didn't even open them. I got these. I got Travis a big thing of green tea. I got him some Mike and Ikes. Um, I bought my nephew a little plastic guitar. He's so cute because he air guitars all the time. And Because they met me at the game. So I gave it to him there and I got him National Geographic flashcards for letters. He didn't really care about that. And I got him a big thing of Teddy Grahams. Well, generic Teddy Grahams. And then I got this. My pad on the bottom, inside, peeled off. So it's like pointless. So I finally got another one. I was in need of that for a while. Got some hair bows, hair ties. I got the thin ones because I have such thin hair, but I also got these because I know it's what I have in my hair right now. But, so. It's just good because they go missing all the time. There's a more household gorilla pads. Got this teething ring. This is for my friend Tony, her grandson. Tony lives at where I work, and that's my girl. And her grandson is stinking gorgeous. Like, he's. How old is he? Four months old? I mean, he is just, I mean, I'm, I'm talking like just a beautiful baby. So I got him this because even though he's young, he's doing all this sucking with this like noise. And so you can, she thinks he might be teething early. So I got him that. So they can at least maybe hold it in his mouth because he's still too young to like do it himself. But that way they can just see if that feels good to him. I got more of this. It's feminine wash. Pretty much explains itself. I don't know if it's doing anything different than my other, but I feel like the older I get, the more I need to take care of that. So, who knows? From the Dollar Tree, like how 
Um, I'm so sorry. He's so annoying. Q-tips. Need those. I go through Q-tips a lot. I clean my ears every day. I know that's not good. But I do it like two or three times a day. I don't like my ears itch at all. And I have very sensitive ears, probably because of that. But, um, I love my, my carpet right now. I vacuum. I have lime, so. Okay, so the other day I told you I went to, um, Joanne's and I got the Velcro to do that whole process with the ink pads. And I had a hard time explaining it. Well, I saw these, and I don't know how secure they are, but I don't think they really have to be that secure for what I want to do it for. They had these, they're called fastener dots, but it's the same idea, and there's 20 in here. So, I might return the Velcro or keep it for something in the future, but this is, this is perfect for what I need. And if you didn't watch the video before, basically, I just want to take my distress, distressor tool, the pad off, and be able to put it under the ink pad that I've used. So I don't waste a bunch and then this way use Velcro on. I need a laugh at non leaves. So oh, I have moved down from my medium size happy planner to my mini one. So um, they had some of the stickers I don't have there, but they they're not gonna work in it. The thing is teeny. So I saw these and I didn't get them for the planner. I got these because I liked the the color, you know, the colors in it. And I just felt like I could use these in other ways, like scrapbooking oh, come on. and stuff like that, or card making and everything. Like that says celebrate. I mean, they're really cute and very, I don't know if rustic-y, but muted, I like it. Plus, my sister loves these colors, this colors. Okay, so I did a lot of video today, but I'm not showing it all to you guys now because I'm gonna wait until my craft room is done. But I decided to wallpaper my wall with um, one wall in my craft new craft room with the contact paper from Dollar Tree. I had two rolls, so I already put those up but based on my calculations, I need seven more because the ceilings here, not in this room, but in there, are like enormous, like super enormous. I don't know how tall they are. So, hopefully I have more instead of not enough, you know what I mean? And that's it. That is it. I get to hear tonight. Good. How exciting. All right, you guys take care and um, hope you all have a great rest of your weekend.